Today, I would like to introduce you to a master of finger painting, Ma Shouwa. Ma, let's start with the top half of the painting first. If we didn't mention anything before, you wouldn't think of it's made with fingers. Then we saw a hill with sunset afterglow on this left side. On the right side, there is also a hill with sunset afterglow. Now, let's look at the bottom half of the painting. Why did he draw this picture? Let's see the inscription on the far right. It reads, "A few rows of red leaf trees and countless mountains bathed in sunset." Based on Rowanning's poem, "Winter of the Gai Sai Year," Ma Shouwa's finger painting. These two seals are Ma's seal Shouhua and Mu Xuan's finger painting. In the winter of 1953, Ma Shouhua used his fingers to paint this. It is a poem written by Ruan Ting. Who is Ruan Ting? He was a Jinshir Palace graduate during the Xuanzhi period (1644 to 1661) of the Qing Dynasty, named Wang Shuxin. Wang Shuxin wrote a poem with four lines, Ma Shouhua, according to the meaning of the second line of the poem. To draw this painting. In addition, there's a seal below reads, "Borrowing my fingers, drawing my ideas." It means he only uses his fingers, then draws what is on his mind. In the far left side of this painting, he wrote another inscription. That is, using fingers to paint, it is easy to be crude and dull. If the painting shows graceful and elegant, your work will be truly superior. This was my epiphany that I am sharing with the viewer. Xiao Jing Juxer, retired scholar, Ma Shouhua, written, recorded again. Then the seal is Xiao Jing Juxer. So this inscription is telling everyone: if you draw with your fingers, what are the most common mistakes? It's easy to be crude and dull. If it shows graceful and elegant, then you get the best work, a superior work. I think if he could comment as written in this inscription, which indicates that this painting must be a fine work in his mind and for sure a satisfied one. Now let's look at this last postscript to the right of the center. That is written as to Ambassador E. D. F. Drumright and Madame Florence Drumright. They came across before returning to America. I selected one of my old works and gave it to them as a parting gift. March seventh. Fifty-first year of the Republic of China, 1962. Gift from Ma Shouhua, Taipei. That is, on the eve of Ambassador Drumright couple returning to America, they went to say goodbye to Ma Shouhua. So, with no other gifts for that time being, Ma Shouhua selected this finger painting fine work done in 1953 and sent it to the couple as a parting gift. At last, one member of the Seven Friends Painting Association, a well-known artist, Lu Yan Tao, used two words to describe the artworks of Ma Shouhua. One is a jing, that is still, quiet and calm. The other is also a jing. It means clean. Owing to Ma Shouhua is obsessed with cleanliness, loves quiet as well as cleanliness. When we look at this painting, it's like going down the stairs. We first saw a few rows of red leaf trees. Further down, not only did we see in the distance countless hills illuminated by the afterglow of the sunset, at the same time, we also felt quiet and peaceful, otherworldly views of these remote mountains. With this painting, we not only feel Ma Shouwa's high moral character, but we also see the masterpiece of finger painting he left behind. It is worth watching in details and to enjoy for its beauty. That's all for today. I hope you will like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.